my channel. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you didn't already know, I'm Mackenzie Lee, back with another video. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe and turn the notific pa notifi patient? notifications on to get notified when I post. Yeah, please and thank you. If you, uh, if you already knew, never mind. Uh, in today's video, if you didn't watch my, it's either my last video or the video before that, that I uh, put out a schedule out there letting people know when I'm posting and what it's about and stuff like that. But if you didn't already know, this is a Q&A. It's a 20 question Q&A. Not a lot of people gave me questions. So um, I kind of had to improvise and do my own questions and get them off of the internet. But that's okay. But yeah. But yeah, so we're just going to do that. I have the whole entire paper right here. On the other side is my Christmas wish list. Haha, ha, you should go watch that. So yeah, my 20 questions. So let's get into the video. Okay guys, so question number one. So there's, there's not a lot of people, but... Who is the person you miss? the most from Edgewood. Okay, there's like a lot of people from Edgewood, but like I only missed like 20 people and that's just too many to name, but the main ones are like, and I highly doubt these people are gonna watch my videos, but the main ones uh, is Abby and Brooke and like Andy and Nikki and Lily. And Allie and John. Like mainly my best friends that I had when I was there. Oh, and Lydia and stuff like that. Ava. Both Lydia's by the way. Oh. Uh, and Lauren and Cadence. And yeah, I miss a lot of those people. But at the same time I don't because I still love my life here. Back in Florida. Oh. Also, please no hate on my sweater. I bought this like two years ago and it looks cute on me. So, yeah, why not? Anyways, on next question. Okay, next question is. So, I guess I didn't post this, my Christmas presents before this person asked this and that's why they asked. But, uh, question two is what did I get for Christmas? I don't feel like explaining that because that's a whole 17 minute video from Saturday. So you can go and watch that and find out what I got for Christmas. So I'm just going to do question three within this because why not? Because question two is very short. What chore do you hate doing? Okay, I hate cleaning the bathroom because it's just... It's just something I don't like doing. Like, I'll clean my bedroom, I'll clean the kitchen, I'll clean the living room, I'll clean everything except for the bathroom. And I don't know why, and I think it's because it just disgusts me. Like, I don't want to clean the toilet, I don't want to clean the shower. Like, I'll clean the mirror and the floor and the counter, but I won't do, like, the shower or the toilet. So, yeah, so let's go on to question four. Okay, <clears throat> question four is what I got from my best friend, because why not? What's my least favorite mode of transportation? Uh, I don't mind riding the bus, it just gets really hot sometimes. So that that's like not my least. Cars are okay, trains I've never been on. It's probably bike, because like that or walking. I hate walking because like it gets really hot and sometimes I wear jeans to school. It's ridiculous. But that is my answer for question four, is walking. So on to question five. Okay guys, question five. What sound do you love the most? 
I love bubble wrap. So I like the sound of bubble wrap. It makes me feel nice. It makes me feel warm inside. Cause like if I don't get to pop the bubble wrap, I get mad. I steal it and I pop it myself and I love it. Yeah. And then question six is what is something you learned in the last week? I learned two things. I learned that you cannot put aluminum foil or anything aluminum in the microwave or like metal stuff in the microwave. And I swear there's something else I learned but I just can't think of it right now. It's funny because it's like something very stupid and that's how I learned it. But yeah, so on to question seven. <laughs> okay, so question seven is where do you like to go when you eat out? Uh, it depends. I like Outback. I like Cheddar's. I like Taco Bell. Uh, oh, I, I love Johnny Rockets. Johnny Rockets is over in the loop. If you live in Florida, I hope you know where that is. Over in the loop by the theaters. I love that place. It is so good. And I think that's kind of all. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to think of a. Oh, Chinese food. I love Chinese food. That's good too. Okay, so I'm just going to do question 8 too. Uh, do you like to cook? Yes. I. It depends on what I'm cooking. Like, I can cook breakfast because I love breakfast. But, like, other things, I get scared of the oven and stuff like that. Like, I, like, back when I was 9 or 10, I used to always make brownies. And I think that's why I'm a little chubby. But I love making brownies. Brownies are so good. And it's just, yeah, it's a yeah. It just depends on what I'm making. So, yeah. On to question nine. Okay, guys, so now it's question nine and ten. Okay, question nine. Could you live without the internet? No. Internet. Internet. Define internet. Like, Wi-Fi. Um, like... Yeah, Google, YouTube, TikTok, Snapchat, Instagram, Defiant Internet. Like, if it was Wi-Fi, I could live without it because I have, um, like, I have unlimited data on my phone, so it doesn't really matter for me. But if you talk about all those social medias and Google, no, nah, bro, I could not live without those. Those are, like, the nest, the nest. Necessities, necessities. You get what I'm saying, though. I could not live without it. They're necessary. Question ten: What would, what would your perfect day be like? Okay. Um. So I like this guy, and I, I told him that I like him, and. Me and him are just best friends, and I don't think he likes me back. And because he said he likes some uh, another girl, and I know who the girl is and everything. But my perfect day would be like, I hope he doesn't see this. Him asking me out, and then we go on a date together. Like that'd probably be my perfect day. That or just him telling me he likes me. Yeah, so let's go on to question 11. Okay. Question 11. Oh my god. When are you the happier? Uh, when I'm with my dog, when I'm at school, when I'm with my crush, when I'm with my mom, when I'm with my best friend, when I'm at a theme park. It depends. Uh, depends on who I'm with to say I'm the happiest. <clears throat> so, question 12. Do you have any trips coming up? 
Well, like my mom, I guess she's supposed to have this thing in February, I believe. Uh, and she, I don't know where she's going, but she said she might take me. It just depends. So, I don't know. It's, yeah, it's like a whole other state. But yeah, I highly doubt she's going to take me, honestly. Honestly. But she might. She might. We don't really get to travel a lot because of her job, so, like, I've gotten used to not going anywhere and leaving my house. So, yeah. On to 13 and 14. Okay, number 13. What is your favorite hobby? Hobby, playing outside, crafts, sports, of course, because sports are, like, the main. Sports are the main. I love sports. I don't know what I'd do without sports. So, yeah. And then number 14. Who is your celebrity crush? Who's my celebrity? Celebrity crush. Honestly, Nick Jonas. His voice is so pretty. Like, I love it. And he's so cute. And... Yeah, so on to 15 and 16. <laughs> okay, guys, number 15. Do you have any pets? Uh, yes, we have the... Sorry, can I... Bro, Zoe. Zoe! We have the beloved Zoe right here in the eyes of all of you. Look at my Zoe. It's my Zoe. It's my Zoe. So, yeah, I love her. Okay, so number 16, what is the first, what is the first thing you notice about someone? Um, it's normally like their hair or like their, their body language mainly, like how they stand or like how they talk. It just depends if like something is going on crazy with their hair, I'll stare at their hair. But if like something with their shoes or like something about their body language like I can't stop staring at it because like it's just it bothers me so like and I'm a very observant person like as my mom said so like observing people is my number one thing like my mom will be like what's wrong and I'll be like nothing that person just gave me a weird vibe like the way they talked and the way they stood and everything like that and she's like you're weird you observe people too much and I was like yeah I know that's how, like, I get good grades in school because, like, I observe everything and, like, what the teacher is basically explaining and it just helps. So, yeah. Hey. So, number 17 and 18. We're almost done. Okay, guys. So, number 17 and number 18. If you could be, if you could be, if you could have lunch with one person, who would it be and why? <clears throat> okay, so the person that I would want to have lunch with would be my my grandpa because um, he passed away back in February 2019 because you guys won't see this until Wednesday and that will be 2020. And yeah, um, he passed away back in February 2019, and um, I haven't seen to him. Uh, I like before he died, I like didn't even get to see him at all. We didn't even expect him to die at all. So um, yeah, that's why I would want to go see him and why. Yeah, I've seen him in my dreams like three times, so like, yeah, and I wish it, I wish it, I mean it probably does mean something, but like, I wish it could be in real life or something like that, so yeah. Number 18 is, what is your spirit animal? Okay, so if you guys don't know this, if you guys like don't hang out with me and stuff like you won't understand, but back in like third, fourth, and fifth grade, I was called lion, 
because people like would make fun of my hair. They said I looked like Mufasa or something. And honestly, that just became my spirit animal. It makes me feel happy. Like lions, they look like huge dogs, which my language arts teacher doesn't agree, which he should, because they look like big dogs with their big paws and their manes. Looks so cute. Anyways, so my spirit animal is a lion. So on to number or question 19 and 20. Okay guys, so number 19. Do you prefer cats or dogs? I prefer dogs, honestly. But like if a cat person asked me that, I would say both because I have dogs, right? And I've always thought about getting a cat, but like my mom is kind of like allergic to them and I'm the only person that's not. And yeah, so, but like I want to become a veterinarian so I like, like I'd have to get used to all animals and cats. But like I kind of don't like have an issue with cats. It's just I prefer dogs more because like, <clears throat> yeah, I love my dog. And cats, they have a litter box, and those stink. Like, it's so bad. They're so gross. So, yeah. So, on to question 20. Do you believe in luck? Of course I believe in luck. My softball number is luck for me, basically. Like, I don't know how to describe it. Like, the very first team I was on, my number was 13. Then, the second team I was on, I made sure my number was 13. Then, for fall ball which is this past uh, season, I made sure my number was 13. For spring, my number should be 13. If it's not, like, I'm going to be so mad. But, yeah, of course I believe in luck. Luck is everywhere. You just have to believe in it for it to be, like, true and stuff like that. Like, for instance, my lucky headband. Uh, and, yeah, that is the only real thing I have that I call lucky. So, yeah. That was question 20. So, yeah, this is the end of the video. Okay, guys, so I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I hope you guys know a lot about me now. Obviously. Because those were 20 questions about myself. So, yeah. That's a lot to know about me, honestly. Because I don't barely ever talk about my... Never mind. I mean, I talk about myself. It just depends. So, yeah. But, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, please give me a thumbs up and smash the like button. Um, yeah. <clears throat> <clears throat> I'm sorry, my throat's been bothering me so bad lately. I have no idea why. But please, I already said like, please subscribe and hit the notification bell so that I know when I post. And, yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. I enjoyed making it because who wouldn't? But anyways, anyways, um, yeah. I love you all. I, have, <clears throat> I hope you have a good New Year's Eve. Yeah. Bye guys, love you, peace. Okay guys, so the question of the day. Question of the day, we're getting it from here. Question of the day is. Oh, okay. Do you prefer cats or dogs? You guys can say both, you guys can say neither, you guys can say cats, or you guys can say dogs. Totally up to you. Please don't forget to comment down and let me know.
Anyways, I love you all. Bye. <laughs>